Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Ben. In this video, I'll explain how to become a data engineer and show you the top data engineer skills and how to gain these skills in data engineering. Now, if you're new to this channel and want to learn about growing your software career and also possibly getting into data engineering, you can start right now by hitting subscribe and click on the bell notification so you don't miss any new videos on this channel. So let's first describe what a data engineer is and what the data engineering career is all about. And oftentimes careers such as data engineers and data scientists can get confusing but a data engineer is, is sort of a hybrid of a data analyst and a data scientist. Now, what does that mean? At the core a data engineer understands software development meaning traditional software development and also back-end development. Now at the core of a data engineering skill set is the ability to, to collect, to store and to process data. Data formats include either text data, streaming data, audio, video, and metadata. For the last several years, the amount of data collected and stored by various software and businesses, and even social media, has grown tremendously. Now, it's not a surprise that the field of data engineering is actually exploding. The question becomes, so how does one become a data engineer? Number one is ability to see data. Now, if you are to become a good data engineer and build a successful career out of it, one of the skills that you need is to have an ability to see data and to see it in everything that you do. And by this, I mean an ability for seeing opportunities to use data to either add value or make profits. The second thing you need to do is identify an industry that you love. Now, one of the best ways of getting started in data engineering is to identify an industry that you love and one that pays well. There are a ton of industries right now that you can get into. According to the 2018 Robert Half Technology Salary Guide, these are the three hot industries in 2018, 19 and beyond. Number one is the healthcare industry. Now, healthcare businesses need professionals with IT expertise to help them modernize their operations and innovate in order to deliver patient care. Number two is financial services. With the economy booming, big data and information security initiatives are driving the need for technology professionals in this sector. So you may want to consider getting into the financial services industry. And number three is manufacturing. Now, this sector has been somewhat slow in adoption when it comes to information technology and IT but actually that is changing very fast. Now, IT talent is becoming increasingly valuable to the industry because of the trend towards automation. So that's another good industry. Something else you wanna do is to work on small data projects you identify. Now, there are many data projects that you can work on to build your portfolio in order to, to become a data engineer. And some of these can be found on free online platforms. Others can be found on Udemy and Coursera. For instance, in my career, I've been able to use some Coursera courses or Coursera certifications to build data or big data products that actually I have used before in my profession. The thing you need to do to become a data engineer is to be an expert in SQL or Python and have an understanding of either Java or .NET or even some other cloud platform technology like AWS or Azure. Now, you can start right now by learning SQL or Python and be on your journey to becoming a data engineer. Now, there are many free resources online such as Udemy or Coursera that can be used to gain these important skills. And I'll list all these skill sets in the descriptions below. Another thing is that data engineers work on data pipelines, data workflows, and ETL. Now, data engineers primarily design, configure, and deploy data pipelines, workflows, and ETLs. And this is just a fancy way of saying that they, they get all the messy data, and they clean the data, transform it, and then load it either into a database or a data warehouse. So data engineers essentially provide clean, reliable, and secure data to data scientists and others in the organization. So again, these are some of the skill sets or abilities for, for any of you guys trying to get into data engineering. So these are some of the tips and some of the strategies I've used in my own career to become a data engineer and actually to grow. If you want to learn more about data engineering and how to become a data engineer, you can start right now by clicking subscribe, hit the bell notification so you don't miss any new content on this channel.